We have we've been done in event for seven years in Odense together with the School of uh, Education at uh, Lillebelt and together with the uh, um, what is it called the um, nursing faculty and also together with the engineering faculty. So uh, the last seven years has been um, close to 500 uh, students. And the best experience is that you have the um, students with different backgrounds combined together in groups of up to uh, 12 or down to uh, four people. And it's very interesting to see how student, students with different backgrounds, they are able to work together within less than one week. They, are, they come with a brilliant solution and new innovative ideas. So this is, um, and I, I see the similar similarities here that uh, students, they have, they're going into this project with open mind. So, and this is very important to, uh, yeah, for, for successful uh, prototypes and innovative ideas. It's involving, as I see that uh, both from the management side and from the teacher side and from the student side, you have uh, evolved from uh, last year because we were here last year as well and it's um, you you it seems that you are uh, you find your own base here and it's uh, very nice to see how you uh, now you're introducing like a new um, a new uh, manual what was it called manual um, a new where you use this um, the As the way man to yeah the, the process of it to, uh, yeah, it's nice that you uh, innovate and use new uh, processes. Yes, so I see similarities. You, we have, um, we all over the world. There's kind of something similar to Innovent, and yes, we see that it's uh, there's an interest to uh, to use it other places in the world because it's it's a good. Uh, either you call it Innovent or you can call it uh, other things, but it's combining students and from different backgrounds it's uh, even if if it's on a higher or lower level it's uh, yeah i see this uh, as a good opportunity